So guys, since it's summer here in the Philippines, as of this time, or upon shooting this video, it so happened that it's also the season of caterpillars. You see this? And another one is here. So it's because of this tree up here, which we call it talisay. So it's like a hive for the caterpillars, and then it's also windy. So every time there's a strong wind that will blow here the shore, there will be a lot of caterpillars. How's the food? My uh, food is good, <laughs> but you know, um, it's, it's kind of homemade. Okay, so this is our breakfast: the French toast and scrambled egg. Um, last night we ordered this in advance because the staff asked a favor um, if we can give them our preferred breakfast. So that we're, we're gonna prepare it before our preferred time for it to be served. And we thought that it's French toast, egg, and bacon. Um, I think we read or we misunderstood the menu. So when we came, it so happened that we only have the French toast and the egg. It doesn't have the bacon. So we were advised that if you'd like to have the bacon, you need to pay extra. So we just chose the complimentary breakfast. Well, for the chocolate porridge, it's already an additional expense. And we also have the bananas. So we'll see you guys later for more of our trip here in Tabuela. First factor would be the location. It is about three to four hours away from Cebu City. That's a private drive or a drive through your private vehicle. And with the rate of the room itself, um, the room is a reasonable type of room, but they could have, let's say, put more interior design on it. And in addition to that, um, we were expecting for a garden view, like there will be a panoramic garden view. But when we'll get out of the room, which happened to be the window slash door of the room itself, it will just lead us to the parking space. And then for the complimentary breakfast, yes, we did misread that, but it would be better if they also include let's say free drinks that come with it because when I asked earlier if it comes with let's say fruit juice it 
doesn't and I ordered for a continental breakfast so I only had the French toast as well as the scrambled egg so there but so far with the services of the crew they are very friendly but it also it could have been better if they also have this let's say orientation on hospitality on how they can answer the phone calls and stuff well I, I'm not saying these just to bash or let's say badmouth about the place itself but this is like a feedback from a customer that would be very useful for you to let's say improve on your services so there stay tuned if you would really like to see more on this resort that we stayed here in Tabuela so guys since we don't like to go home or go back to the city yet uh, we look for another resort around Tabuelan so we found Maravillas oh, so 25 rang room yeah 25 rang room so I'll show you later the accommodation as well as the beach front and it will be a great experience so we'll just have to grab late lunch with Clem so see you later so since we did not have lunch earlier um, we went back to the neighboring town which happened to be Tuburan so nakakita mi o karinderia and later we'll do some grocery shopping because it's an unplanned staycation in Maravillas that's in Tabuelan because again we still don't like to go back to the city so we just have to relieve our stress with the beach. So let me give you a little bit of a humba. Supposedly, dili di siya garais. Kito <laughs> Kito diet. Pero ang humba, lamik ba dyan ko no? Walang. Para di mo ang spiritus mo. Oo. Oh. Wala na. Nag-order dyan ng garais ay. Eh. I-additionalan yun. So, kaningatkan andan na ara diri sa tuburan. Masa yung pangayang ang nidiringatkan andan to eh? Atis, lotong ba? Oo, diba? Lamik kayo. Prince Royal House. At bang sa Prince Royal House diri sa tuburan. So, ang pangayang katis, lotong bahay, lotong bahay dyan siya. Lamik hmm. kayo guys. Rayotan Bisaya, um, Humba, Pork Shop, and then the Dinuguan. Lami, kayo nga unta. Guys, naday ko ipala ilan ninyo. <laughs> Since naman ta sa Katis, dutong bahay, nga karindiriya. Wala siya nagpaila ilan, nga siya si Kati. Pero tanawa ko sa kapaspas, muhiwa. <laughs> Bitter kayo, kaya ang palaya ang gihiwa, pero ti paspas sa ilan. Oh, di ba pas pas kayo? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Kay summer man, ya init kayo. Sa timing ah, uh, pagpadung na mo sa resort as we drove back to the resort. Nami nakita ang halo-haloan dere. Eh. So gimingaw sa ko sa halo-haloan sa akong best friend dito sa Bohol. Pero kay naara man mi dire sa Tabuelan, pero sa tuburan pa ning iya. Morning ah, halo-halo na nakita. This is words halo-halo. So after sud noon, palit ang halo-halo kay
Lord. Kuya kay Mudara si Ate Og Story at ay naglakaw lang. Yeah, so tiyan namin niya. Kaya lang siya man, like a social distancing. Sigun sa ilang siya man? Like social distancing. One meter. One meter apart. One inch. Kaya lang siya man. Kaya lang siya man. Kaya lang siya man. Padung Cebu, from the northern part going back to Cebu City. So this is the penthouse. Why the... We're already here in Katmon, particularly Barangay Makaas. So there's like a stall or few meters of stalls that are selling the native rice cake, which yes, it's freshly cooked. Still, I'm with Clement. 
So going back to this rice cake, we locally call it bibingka. So it will be very delicious if you'll have this on your snack time or breakfast and you're gonna put butter or lard or the margarine on top of it. So there, let's go down and buy these local delicacies here in Katmo. So for those who are curious, the small size happens to be 5 pesos and the bigger size is 10 pesos. So we're here, Mila, Bibinka, and Rose Bibinka. That's Ate Rose, Ate Mila. So guys, I didn't know it was so good. Pali it's a bibingka. It's there. Sakat mo nyo, sorry. Sakat mo. So, so barangay ka as. Dili sa cut moon. Cut moon to, sorry kayo. Dili so good. Cut moon. Kaya, muna ang bibingkahan. Para to rin, lamit kayo. Kapalit ka. Sabahan na ko eh. So, ikaw na ayaw. Yan siya, kapalitan. No? Cinco, yeah. Tila, tila dito eh. Nag-cinco, sir. Cinco. Nag-cinco, nag-cinco, sandagko. Cinco, sandagko. Oh, my cinco. Ini saya ibu. Buka unsur tu kembali. Tiga putih, sepinta. Apa nak? Unsur mau rasa yang soli galut tu senyum bibing kate. Mangalas. Quatro, las tres. Ya unsur rasa ura, yang soli mahurut. Ingatkan kan aku nanti alas cinco. Jangan jadi tahu kesegaran domingo. Sige, salamat! Salamat! Salamat, sir! Kung sa'yo na? Mount Kapayas. Mount Kapayas? Ah! Masa na? Ada pizza? Bukid! Bukid yun? Salamat, sir! Oo! Kayo sa gayo? Sama! Kayo sa gayo, sir! Kayo sa gayo? Kayo sa gayo, sir! Pero tulad kayo! So there, guys! We're here in Katmun! buying these bibingka or the rice or native rice cake it will be more delicious if you're gonna put margarine or the lard or butter on top of it but since you're also having the authentic bibingka okay na kay kuhani so guys here is the bibingka it's a little mukbang or short mukbang Served, freshly served from the native oven. So, how's the taste, Plum? Tabe? Mmm, Kuang is chef. Mini pressure guy. Sometimes this is also good if you put um, quick melt cheese on top of it. Lami. Yummy. Lami means yummy. <laughs> it so happened that there are motorcycles that are parked in front and at the back of this vehicle so that's why I could not really move out from this side parking area should I say so that's why we took it while waiting we took the we took advantage of the time to eat the bibingka. I'm dropping down.